Welcome, I'm Alex from Suji, and I'm gonna walk you through how to set up a session on your Generation 2 device. So we're gonna start by unzipping the EVA carry case, which we recommend that you store and travel with your Suji device in. We're first gonna pick out the compression garment. Taking notice of the Velcro strip, and the docking station on the front. Taking your pneumatic compression device, take notice of the magnets on the back and the alignment strip, how it matches with the docking station on the compression garment. Placing a thumb behind the compression garment, take the pneumatic compression device over the top, aligning in place and pressing firmly down. You should hear an audible click of the magnets connected. You can ensure that it's securely fastened by just grabbing it once connected. Once connected to the front of the docking strip, take the compression garment around the topmost portion of the limb, stepping the leg forward and fastening it in place with the long Velcro strip. Ensure there is visual alignment of the top layer of the compression garment over the bottom and ensure there is at least one inch of overlap between them. Place the device on the outside of the leg twisting the compression garment as needed. Once on the leg, we can simply press on and off with the on off button on the front, getting a nice LED indication as to whether the device is on or not. Now, if you bought the Suji Duo set with the Generation 2, you can of course repeat the process and attach the second compression garment. Again, taking the device over the top of the docking station, taking notice of the alignment strip, placing the magnets over, pressing firmly, hearing the audible click, and ensuring there is a strong and firm connection. Place the leg forward, take the compression garment around the topmost portion of the limb, and secure in place with the Velcro strap. Visually ensure that the top layer is on top of the bottom, and that there is one inch of overlap, placing the device on the outside of the limb, and again, turning on. With both devices turned on, or if you bought the Suji Uno, one device turned on, we can now connect to the Suji app where we will be guided through the rest of our session. Once the compression garments are inflated and you have the in-app prompt to complete your exercise, you are now free to do your exercise completely cable free. Once I've completed my exercise or in between sessions, I can deflate the compression garments in-app by pressing the deflate button. If I have completed my exercise, also feel free to simply remove the device, hearing the air rush from the compression garment and feeling the compression garment completely deflate. Once my session is complete, take either one or both the devices off, ensure they are turned off and place back in the EVA carry case. Simply remove the compression garment from the limb by unzipping the Velcro strip, tightening up, and placing back into the carry case. Now, if I want to clean my equipment between use, I can simply take an antibacterial or a wet wipe, as well as a dry cloth and wiping the equipment down. Just be mindful that when wiping down the hardware, you thoroughly dry it off using the dry cloth. Once placed in the EVA case, you can simply zip up the carry case and it's stored away, ready for next use.